Well, I'm that N to the I to the N to the A, better known as B, 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 D. A motivating, captivating personality with weight loss, hair care, yeah, you know with me. Much more than a diva, hard hitter, never quitter, and a winner, so you know that I will. Seek to educate, regulate, never violate, never teach and hate, but I will participate at a high rate and live. Hi, YouTubers, it's your girl, Beautiful Brown Baby Doll, and I'm coming at you today because I'm kind of disturbed by something that's happening right now. So you all know Gabby Douglas, who is currently going for the gold, wonderful, young, uh, beautiful 16-year-old gold hopeful medalist of the Olympics in gymnastics this year. Uh, this young lady is phenomenal. Uh, and she's doing a wonderful job. Have y'all seen her physically fit? Looks like she's at her peak. My goodness, 16 years old, big ups to Gabby Douglas, amazing girl. Now what's been happening lately is I'm finding that more and more women are talking about and complaining about her hair. Why does this bother me? Why are you vlogging about this? Well, because uh, as you remember last week I made a video concerning somewhat of the same thing. Uh, your hair looks awesome, but you're dying pretty much. And I'll paste a link to that video. Women are complaining about Gabby's hair, saying that it looks a mess. Uh, will somebody do something with her hair? Um, all of these various idiocracies, if you ask me. All of these silly tomfoolery-ish type uh, things that you can say. But today, I got pretty upset about it, seeing some of the posts about it. Uh, one of my favorite sites, you all have to uh, check it out, Sporty Afros, did a wonderful detailed article about the matter. Check them out. I'll have a link to their website down below in the article they did about it. Just uncovering the ugliness behind people talking about this young girl's hair. Now, you see I've mentioned all these wonderful things about her and how she's only 16 doing all of this. I'm done being nice. I rest my case on the nice part. Let me get down to business. First of all, the girl is 16 years old. How many of y'all had it all together at 16? I don't know about y'all, but I was wearing my hair in some Queen Latifah-ish type style that might have looked a hot mess. I don't know. I was worried about going to school, being on the ground, let alone had God had blessed me at that time to be an Olympic finalist and, and, and be a gymnast. God knows what my hair would look like. So first off, let, let, me, give, let me get at that. Secondly, it's our own people, black women flooding, not our own, because I know I have uh, viewers of all colors. So let me just say this. Black women were making a big deal about this little girl's hair by how it looks a mess because she wears like the little ponytail in the back and her hair and her edges look this way. Hold up, y'all. First off, she's a gymnast. She is a little worried about what her hair looks right, like right now, making sure she gets them flips right, them floor exercises, them beams right, making sure she get them bars right. How about that? How much have you gotten right this year and since you were 16? Secondly, I posted, or thirdly, I don't know what number I'm on. I, I'm just upset. I'm just going to just keep numbering. I don't care if I say 10 right now. How about I put on my Facebook fan page. This is why you need to like my fan page. Lots of things go on for those of you that just watch me on YouTube. You want to come on over to the fan page, Instagram, all of that. I post about these different things. Um, on my fan page, I talked about how... Actually, let me just post the post that I put up on my fan page. Actually, after I posted it, some people had the nerve to get upset. And I it wasn't on my fan page that people got upset. Actually, those people were happy. But I remember on my personal page, some people got upset about this. Um, it said, like, well, I wouldn't go there. And why would you say all that? Well, the problem with us is, the problem is we focus on the wrong things. She can have her, her fried dye laid to the side looking good, but she's falling off the balance beam and falling off the mat and, and doing everything else wrong in the Olympics and y'all will be happy? If her hair looked a certain way, if somebody had dressed up and made her look like you think she's supposed to look, then you'd be happy? How about the fact that the chick has her stuff straight at 16? Her body 
is right. Her mind is right. Her agility is right. She's beautiful both inside and outside. She's doing something that most of you will never do. And this is the problem that we have today. I could get cancer today. Gabby could get cancer today. You could get cancer today and have no hair because of chemotherapy. How about that? Have you lived your life to the fullest? Have you done what's necessary to say that you've done a lot in this world, that you fulfilled your purpose? No, you're too worried about a hairstyle. You're too worried about what you're looking like. You're too worried about what the trend is. You're too worried about the style you're supposed to have. Come on, people, get it together. We're still dying because we're only thinking about the small picture. So until we think about the bigger picture, our health as a whole, how about this child is healthy? This young woman has learned things that I in my life have never learned. But this is what we do. It's the crab in the barrel effect. She's wonderful at everything. So let me pull her down on something. Let me talk about something that's wrong with her. And, and I hate to get hype about it. And I hate for y'all to think that I'm just mad. I'm not mad. Come on now. I'm from the hood. This is how I talk. First off, for all of y'all that's about to comment about me getting upset and saying, but this is how I talk. So if that offends you, I'm sorry. When I get passionate, that's how I am. It's not about being mad. We're so focused on the wrong things. We're not focused on our health. We're not focused on fitness. We're not focused on being the best we can be. We're focused on how good our hair can look. Again, from the neck up, wrist down, ankles down. That's it. Everything in between sucks. And everything in between here sucks. Your brain. I don't even understand where we're coming from, where we get the nerve to do the things and say the things that we say. And I only get so upset about this situation, guys, because these are the same things that I feel that I've encountered in my life. And I want you all to comment on this. I want to hear some video uh, rants, discussions, responses. I want to see some people post on this video and talk about the experiences they've had with this. I know that even when I was getting my PhD, even when I was losing weight, even when I was changing my life, even when I was trying to make big strides, the focus of other people, even though my focus was right where it should be, was on the minute things. The minute things. I remember one of the first things when I got my first interview for the professor to become a professor, to become a psychologist. My first questions I got was, girl, how you going to wear your hair? How about we make sure that my curriculum vita and resume is right? How about we think about my qualifications? How about we think about my hookups and the people I know and my networking skills? Think about the right things right now. You know what I'm saying? Like we're not even on the right playing field. We out here somewhere and the fact of the matter is right here. Think about the big picture, guys. I, that's all I want you to do. Grow out of this. Just just reconstruct, redevelop. Just, just think. Get yourself together. I'm tired of it, man. Whew. Okay. I love y'all. Uh, beautiful brown baby doll. Peace. Well, I'm that to the I to the N to the A but I know that if you'd like to see more natural hair and weight loss videos from me click on the videos and they'll take you straight to my playlist thanks so much for all your love and support continue to rate comment share and most of all subscribe to see beautiful brown baby doll grow much like it is golden blessing brains with the knowledge and the skills to be real while they pass that elite